Stay a while and listen. Hello, welcome back to the Freak Show. Bobby McSquiggums here. I want to thank you all for joining me as we take a trip back in time, back to the 16-bit era of gaming, to one of the greatest games ever made. That's right, I'm talking about Shining Force 2 for the Sega Genesis or Master Drive system. And right now we're playing that on PC because, you know, things... But yeah, that's what we're doing. We're playing Shadow Force 2, and I am... Oh, I'm always excited. This is one of my favorite games ever made, so... Definitely gonna be bringing it to the forefront, playing it a little bit, mm-hmm. Showing a little bit of that love to that Sega. Mm hmm Sega. Good stuff. Alright, so we're gonna go and we're gonna chill up here. And we're gonna wait. And uh, the many, 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 many gizmos are gonna be gizmo sizing and doing stuff. All right, we're gonna have to hope that we can kind of pull them maybe one at a time. Like this is a, I don't know if this is the roughest, this is not the easiest of battles. And the reason this is not the easiest of battles is because we're outnumbered by like what, five to three? One, two, no, six to three. It makes it difficult for lack of a more accurate term. So things get real questionable, I guess? All right, our priest should be relatively tanky. Ooh, she hit by three. Mm. Well, that's not great. All right, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna smack the gizmo. Smack, smack the gizmo. And we did four damage, it's not bad. It's not bad, Bob did okay. Bob did all right. And it looks like they are uh, spreading themselves out in a weird pattern, so we should be able to take this down with good old chesty westy here. All right, well done, Chester. Next up, Sarah's gonna move over here. I'm gonna scoot back with Bob, and we'll see if anybody else decides they want to come down and play. I assume you're gonna come down and hit Chester. Yeah, that's what I, that's what I figured. That's gonna hit for two. Okay, we're gonna back up with Chester. We're not gonna fight him where he's at right now. Because again, we're gonna try to stay outside of their like pull range, if you want to call it something. Because they're going to start moving down. And yeah, I figured they'd start targeting Bob. Probably going to do four damage, is my guess to Bob. No, oh, only three. It's not bad. Alright, so Bob's going to lay this guy out with a big old three hit, four hit, zero hit. Because of course he's going to miss everything because he's terrible and nobody likes Bob. So Sarah's going to step up and she's going to do some damage. There she goes. She landed a three attack. That's fine. More folks are kind of moseying. Oh, she gets a double. All right, we'll give you the double. Take him down. Show him what's what. Hit him with that stick. Yeah. All right, so the gizmo done got whooped. Feeling pretty good. It's all right. It's good. It's compelling. It's rich. Not about that, but it's, it's a thing that's happening. All right, I'd like to move away, but again, it might be a little bit too late for it. So we're going to have to make sure that we can drop one. Oh, only two damage there. One or two more of these guys before we get completely swarmed or swamped, if you will. Alright. And, yeah, so one for each of us. They could all just turn on Sarah and attack right now, and that would go very poorly for us. They could also turn all on to Bumpy and attack. Uh, mm, I'm going to try to lay this one out. And it could be a mistake. Like I might not have, I might not have should have done that thing in there that we did. Hmm. Maybe I move here and I use a medical herb. It looks like Bob is just a little bit too weak right now, so he gets hit pretty hard. Cause the others seem to be able to defend themselves a little bit better. fine. Okay, he's still protected. Can you land the attack? Can you not miss this time? Is that a thing you can do? Okay, it is. Good. Alright, so another gizmo down. Now it's on to sort of even playing ground, if you will. Still a bit concerned, but less so. I'm going to go ahead and throw a heal on to Sarah. She can heal herself up. Alright. 
Okay, now you're gonna focus, Sarah, that's fine. Okay, so we're gonna go over here and we're gonna attack from this side. And we're gonna try to bring down this gizmo. Again, it's gonna require us actually landing attacks. I know, shocking to be sure. Can you do it, Sarah? Do you have the. Yeah, she's got the moxie to bring it on and take him down. I like it. Alright. Gizmo was intent on going after Sarah. It's like, mm mm. No little healer girl is gonna take out my brethren. Also, we're gonna attack your main boy, Bob, over here. And he going down like a sweet muffin. Mm hmm. They're like, well. Sweet muffin. Eh. Oops. Wrong button. Sorry. Mm, there we go. Got it. Attack with the old wooden stick of doo doo. Ooh, a critical hit. And it's for three. It's for three. A critical hit for three. Ouch. Alright, still hitting the wrong buttons. It's fine. It's fine. Attack, eh? Very nice. Alright, 24 points. All right. It's down to one. You don't have enough damage to disperse amongst us. You are done, Senor Gizmo. You are done. And uh, on a totally unrelated and side note, a shout out to uh, my, my co-worker Courtney and her having lost her, her little rat, her rat-a-tat-tat, her rat from uh, her pet rat, uh, about how long ago it was? Maybe six months ago? His name was Gizmo. That's why I, I bring it up. So shout out to her and, you know, sad for the loss of Gizmo. Anyway, but this is not the same kind of Gizmo. And we defeated these and we are good. And we have defeated the nasty bad things that were going to possess people. Well done, Bob. What should I do with this devil? Well, I have many, 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 many plans that we can do with this devil. First off, we'll let him blind us with his flashy lights, and then he's gonna disappear. Oh, it disappeared. And then he's gonna appear behind us, and he's gonna teleport away. Oh, there it is. You gonna do it again. Ah, it disappeared again. Ah, there it is. Yeah, he, he's running back to the, yeah. Mm -hmm. We must hurry to the king. You get the idea. Alright, maybe not quite as iconic as the uh, Shiny Force 1 music, but still, you know, it has its merits. It's it's quite good. It is quite good. Bum, bum, bum. Onward! We must save the world and the king from the evil gizmo. That can't be good. He looks very flat. Hello, sir. He's fainted. Oh. Shameth upon him. All right. And we are here. What's up? Well, boy, did you hear a strange noise? I don't know why, but everybody ignores my questions. Sorry. I'm ignoring your question. What's going on? I saw a devil enter the king's body. And the king became violent. Uh huh? Or did he play a violin? Princess Alice, I can't let you go up there. <laughs> Trust Sir Astral, he knows how to kill the king. Does he? Does he know? Let me pass. I must see my father. Mm. Oh, ouch. I didn't think he'd be so strong. Ouch. I, I was knocked down. Don't, don't brag about that, man. Hurry to the princess's bedroom. Hold the king down. Excuse me? The king knocked down the princess. <gasps> Blasphemy. Alright, I'm going up. And here we are. King versus Sir Astral. King Grand Seal. Calm down. He's possessed. He needs an exorcism right now. Oh, great. Just get your butt up and shake your head. There you go. Ow, my head. No, no, I'm okay, Bob. I'm good. I must use a powerful spell. It may be dangerous. Stand back. 
Alright, what we got? What we got? What we got? Ooh, he's shiny. Ooh. Evil spirit inside the king be gone. Kame. Fireball. Right. Hadouken. I know. It's fine. King Grand Sail? Did it work? Well, you see the evil gizmos right there, dude. So obviously, obviously it worked. And then he just floats through the sky. Because why not? Uh, Astro, wha what happened? Are you alright? Let me use your soldiers. We must kill it before it finds another victim. What are you talking about? I don't understand. They faint. <laughs> Astra! And that's how babies are made. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Uh, Astral is exhausted. He won't wake up. The minister summons the soldiers to the hall to kill the evil spirit. Bum, bum, bum. That's all the info I can give you about the mission. So all we have to do is find the evil gizmo and kill him. That's right, kill him before he possesses somebody else. You may go. Yes, sir. Let's go and defeat the evil gizmo. Oh, yeah. Forward, men. Yes, it's wonderful. Sorry. I'm losing my mind slightly. It's okay. I never had much one to begin with. It's fine. Sir Astral is still sleeping. Is he all right? The king is upstairs looking in on Sir Astral. I am worried. Is he gonna be okay? Uh, we, we, we are, uh... He just fainted because he was exhausted by the two battles. Don't worry about him. If he dies, it doesn't matter. He's old anyway. Wow. Wow. What? Okay. Minister? Is the minister here? Well, not for long if he keeps talking that nonsense. Here I am. Did our soldiers leave for the subjugation? Indubitably. Just a few minutes ago. Slow walk up to his throne, his chair. Oh. Hmm. I'm too late. Astral came back to his senses just now. That's great! Did you talk to him? I mean, it doesn't matter if he died, because he's old anyway, but, you know, did you talk to him? Astral said he feels an ill omen behind the opening of the tower. And Gizmo appearance, appearing. Okay, that's fine. We must study the ancient history of Grand's Island. How? Probably books, we might get. A historian named Howell. Lives northwest of Yil. Astral asked me to send soldiers for him, but... Ah! I understand. What should we do now? What should we do? Ah! Oh, yes! Yeah, it's a great idea! Minister, I have a good idea! Me too! You're the pupils of Astral. I know of you. Bob, I heard that you did a very good job in the ancient tower. Let me butter you up. We have a horribly dangerous job that you are absolutely not qualified for. We're going to send you out to your death. I mean, no, we're, you're going to do a favor for the king. Why don't you go to Yeel and bring back, uh, bring Howell back? Here. I don't think this is a difficult job. Will you go? Uh, yeah, we're not qualified for such things, unfortunately. I feel like we're going to have to pass at this point because, like, we're children and we have wooden sticks that we fight with. Oddly, super powerful possessing ghosts are vulnerable to wooden sticks, but, yeah, you know, but that's about where it ends. We end up fighting soldiers that have real weapons and it's just going to go bad. So I'm going to say, yeah, no, we're, we're not, we're, okay, fine. You refuse the king's, what, what excuse me? Didn't I say yes? I could have sworn. Okay. Well, yes? No? What? No? 
Oh, oh, I'm, I'm hitting the wrong button. Okay. Yeah, yeah, no, totally, yes, thank you. First try. Depart to fetch Howl immediately. <laughs> Sorry, guys, on the PlayStation controller, the X button is usually next, 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 you know, you advance dialogue and everything else. That's actually my back button. So, yeah, I'm just used to doing that to advance dialogue. So that's why we kept refusing accidentally. Uh, yeah, well, sure, we're, we're going to do that thing that you want us to do. Because, you know, again, we're totally qualified for this, like, super ultra-important mission. Um... Have you seen or smelt any sulfur? I'm an inventor. I'm looking for some sulfur. Yeah, can you not stand there? Is, is that... Guy? It's gonna... Okay, whatever. There's a chicken. Baka! Uh -huh. Baka! Alright, do we... Oh. What is... What's the... Hey. Me! <laughs> I'm so hungry! Hungry! What's up? He looks so sad, I feel sorry for him. Me too. Release me! Get me out of here or I shall eat you up! I'm gonna eat you up! The human caught me when I was taking a walk in Parmesia. Welcome! We have very novel animals from the mainland. You don't want a pet. I'll lower my prices for you. Hmm, yeah, no. All right, I think it is time for us to leave this depressing place. Also, I feel like we should probably buy better equipment. But since we don't possibly have money, I don't. I don't know. I don't really. I have no idea. Hear what I have to say. I can see the ruins in my crystal. The war. Grand Sil will fall in the war. Believe me. Okay. What do we say? Why don't you stop by my shop before you set out on your journey? Okay. What's up, boy? We guarantee all items to be in good condition. Alright, what do you got? I would like to buy a short sword. That does seem like a good item to buy. 140? I am... Yes. Who do you think gets it? The man, the myth, the legend, Bob. Ah. Uh, Yeah, it's fine. Give it to Sarah. To Chester. Yeah, yeah, it's fine. Just give it to somebody, okay? What I want to do, I want to buy a... Um... Spear. Sure. Who do you think gets it? The same person who got the last thing. Yeah, he's gonna equip it too. Thank you. I would like to now sell items if that's a thing that you're okay with. Which items do I want to sell? Well, I mean, Chester just got equipped with a not wooden stick. So why don't you buy the wooden stick? You can use it for, I don't know, hopscotch? I, I've, got, I've got nothing. And then Sarah's fine, but we're going to get rid of our wooden sword because, again, it's a wooden stick. Okay, so that's it. So we're done. Yay, everybody's rejoicing. Uh huh. Be good, be glad, merry, doing stuff. Okay. Wrong button combination. Item. Give. Chester, give your sword to... Who? To Bob. To good old Bobby to Bob. And then we're going to go ahead and we're going to equip Bobby to Bob with the sword. And now he is a million times... All right, slightly more powerful than he once was. Here you are. I've been waiting. What's up, Jaha? The soldier said you went into the castle. Is that true? Aw, oh, I missed it. I would have woken up early if I knew that. So I came to meet you here, Bob. You're going to Yale, right? How do you know all this stuff? Like, we just found out like 10 seconds ago, technically. Canonically speaking, it was it was a very short time ago. Under the king's orders? Cool! Of course I'm going too! Jaha the War has joined the force. Sweet. Let's go, LG. Life's good, and let's go. All right, let, let's actually go. Dun, 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 and immediately we just get thrust into battle. All right, so we got some slammity slammy slimes. We got a big old fat rat. 
Another slime and a slime and a slime and another fat old fat rat and another slime. Alright, so lots of slimy rats, I guess is what we're, we're getting at here. Okay. Alright, we gonna stand our ground there. Is the rat gonna come and attack? Maybe? No? We're not, we're not, we're not entirely positive. Alright, Priestess. That is your real name. Come over here, and Jaha is ready to... I'm hoping Jaha pulls, you know, his weight. He's, he starts whooping some some booty. He starts beating down some peeps. I think the ooze is going to hurt a little bit. Oh, God in heaven. Yes, that was not a fun experience. He just did six... He just did half my HP in one move. Not something we really were hoping to experience. Alright, what's the rat going to bring? There's a huge rat... Okay, I feel like this is bad. Spear, we can attack from range, so we can kind of... Bloop! Yeah. First try-ish. Not, not really. Oh boy. I'm gonna try to put some distance between ourselves and the old rat. Because he looks like he hurts more than a little bit. Well, we critically hit for five, and Bob became level two. His HP goes up, his MP goes up by one, his attack by one, his defense by one, agility by one, and he found ten gold coins. The dude's lucky. Okay, um, yeah, you both got, like, half destroyed there, so we're gonna throw a heal on you, like, instantly. I mean, it's kind of silly. The, uh, the rat's kind of horrifying, like, how strong it is right now. It's okay, though. It's good. Oh good, she leveled up. HP by one, MP by one, attack by one, <laughs> defense, <laughs> and agility. So, I mean, kind of the same thing, but meh. It's not as impressive when she does it. I'm just saying. Alright, let's attack the rat with the Warrior of Doom. Jaha! Yeah! 16 or something? Oh dear. Oh, I'm worried. I'm worried. Okay, that hurt. That hurt a little bit. Oh, that's not good. I think he dies. Yep, he died. He got hit by five, so did literally exactly the right amount of damage. Well, that's bad. Welcome to hard mode, ladies and gentlemen. Where all your nightmares are truly the dreams of the enemy. Bonk. Well, I should level up off of this. Oh, if I was fighting with the other guy, maybe. You dead. I will probably join you in that being dead thing here soon. Alright, the attack! Alright, we became level 2. 1 HP, 1 attack, 2 defense, and 1 agility. Good, this defense went up a little bit. Which is desperately needed. Oh dear. Will I live? Will I live? I will not live. Alright, so we're going to get thrown back into town, basically. So there's going to be some growing pains, guys and gals, if you hadn't guessed. There'll be a little bit of the growing pains. It's probably fine. Yeah, I need to be resurrected. Yeah, he's kind of beat up. Ten gold coins, well spent. So, it being on a harder difficulty, it will probably take me a little bit before we're strong enough to survive. Like, right now, it's literally, like, two attacks can just ruin us. So, yeah, it, like I said, it'll, it'll be a little bit of a, a little bit of work, a little bit of struggling, but we should be able to get through it relatively easy. Okay, and we're back. Dun, 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 dun. Chester's is going to go right after the ooze and get some, some damage out on that. And hopefully we can pull these a little bit easier, like less murder, murder and death on our side. Probably be better. Chester's going to try and tank it. He should be okay. It shouldn't be anywhere near as strong as it was before. Only did three this time. Last time I brought him from 11 to 4. I mean, that was... That was quite tremendous. 
Alright. Okay, we just need a couple of levels early on and we'll be, we'll be feeling better. Okay. We're about out of time for the episode. I'm going to go a little bit longer. We might be able to finish up this fight if things go smoothly. I mean, I'm not really expecting them to go smoothly, but I mean, maybe? The rat... Oh, I was expecting the rat to move further. This seems like a bad idea. Seems like a real bad idea, doesn't it? Let's not do that. Yeah, see, he moved immediately after. Alright. We'll let them kind of close with us, I guess. The rat should go first, and... Ooh, attacking the healer. Unexpected. Alright. Well, we're gonna smack the rat. Boom! Six hole damage done to the old ratling. And, um... Don't particularly like putting him into harm's way, but it's fine, probably. Ooh, we're level three. Double HP increase, one to attack, one to defense, and agility by two. I'll take it. We're starting to outpace everyone. It's too early to outpace people, I know. It's, it's fine. Okay, so three damage done. Nice. Jaha's got very little to worry about right now. Bumpy still, or sorry, Bob still has a little bit more. I just sworn the last one was Bumpy. I feel like there should have been enough letters, but it could have been something else. I don't remember. Alright. The attack is real. Alright, Chester's level 3. 2 to HP, 1 to attack, 1 to defense, and 1 to agility. I think I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna attack this. I'm gonna soften them both up and try to get the others to get the kill. Ooh, seven. That's impressive. Good job, Bob. Alright. Let's take out the ooze that's only got two HP. I don't know how strong she's gonna hit for. Four. So, fairly strong still. And then Jaha. Come on, buddy. I believe. I believe in you. Oh, we're going to get hit again. I still believe in you, though. I do. They have not... They have not narrowed my belief in you at all. Alright. Big old smackety 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 poo. Bonk. Level up? Maybe? 49. Yeah, level 2. HP by 2. Attack by 1. Defense by 1. Okay. Okay. I'm feeling it. I also did this fight slightly better, so, you know, it doesn't look quite as bad as it did before. Alright, I am going to heal you. Come on. Do you have an item? He still does. I think we're okay. The rat should come out and attack. He's gonna attack Chester. That's what I figured. Should only do six? At best? Okay, he's only doing three. He's not even... He, he's pulling his punches at this point. I mean, like, even I can handle that. Jeez. Jaha's like, heh! I scoff at your weak, lame self. The amazing difference, like, one level can make. It's crazy. Alright. So I'm going to throw a heal on to Chestire. Alright. Chester's feeling okay. Sarah should be doing okay, too. Getting a little higher up in the levels. Alright. I'd like the rat down first. That's that's my, my goal here. So we can do six damage? Yeah, we are. Always doing a double? What? Get wrecked, rat. A little bit of wasted experience there, because, you know, we could have gotten a little bit plus the 49, but I'll take it. Alright, slimy slime, what do you got? You gonna dodge me? You gonna you gonna ooze flash past me? Nah, I don't think so. Six damage there. Oh, and we're level four. Plus two to HP, one to attack, one to defense, agility by one. 
Just, just remember, I will die my way to victory. Sometimes. And we said good day, sir. There it is. The ooze has been defeated. Chester is well on his way to the next level. Alright, and there we go. Alright, so our goal is to go up there and do that. But that is going to be a tale for another time. So that's going to be in the next episode we go up there. Uh, we'll do whatever we have to do. We'll get Howl or his apprentice or something. I don't know. It's been a long time, guys and gals, since I've played this. And yeah, it'll be fun, I think. I think it'll be fun. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you guys enjoyed. And until the very next episode, my name is Bumpy Vicks Quiggums. Thank you guys so much for stopping by the channel, hanging out here at the Freak Show, and I'll see you later. <laughs>